can make it work. We can make it twerk. Welcome back to Extra Holiday Games. I'm Extra Holiday and we're over 2 billion points. That's crazy. <laughs> now let's get over 2 billion subscribers. <laughs> Sorry, uh, I don't know what came over me. Uh, <laughs> uh, whoop, ah, oh, fuck. Hey, man. Goofing off too much, and now I lost the ball. Oh, well. Okay, well, uh, hey, how, 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 how's it going? Uh, how are you? I'm doing fine. Anyway. <laughs> um, I was going to say, uh, you'll notice I don't make a habit of doing things like that, you know, saying, bringing up how many subscribers I am, or asking people to subscribe, or like, or comment, or whatever. Like, sometimes I'll ask, you know, I'll prompt people to comment if I have something I genuinely want to hear from them about, but, um, yeah, I, I, that is intentional. It is intentional that I'm not like, hey, if you like the video, please, you know, the rest. Um, it's because you know the rest, really. And I got, I, <laughs> as someone who watches a lot of YouTube and has been watching a lot of YouTube for um, the past, I don't know, probably, oh, thank you, Pikachu. Probably the past 10 years at this point. Um, I've heard that a lot. Like, a nauseating amount. So, uh... It just, it just, it bothers me. I don't like to hear other people say it. Because I've heard it so... So many times. <laughs> so I don't say it myself. Uh, it's not even like, a, oh, I'm better because, you know, I... I don't say it sort of thing. It's just, I don't like it, therefore I don't want to subject other people to it. <laughs> That's all. Uh, hopefully, hopefully you all appreciate it. Um, Cause I, part of me, part of me is like, you know, would I be, you know, would my numbers be better if I did? You know, they say it works, so... You know, maybe, maybe, uh, but still, still, uh, I say nay. I'd, I'd rather not. I do get tempted. I do get tempted at times. But no, there, there, there is a reason why the only time that phrase has been said on this channel, it was not said by me. <laughs> and thanks for that, Jacob. <laughs> Jacob absolutely would say it if he had a YouTube channel. Absolutely, he wouldn't hesitate in the slightest. But that's just because he's cooler than me, you know? So, uh, yeah. No. Oh. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's an interesting place this year. YouTube. Tube of... See, I was trying to get it to the lining on the left, and that's why I waited so long, but I waited too long, and it didn't. Anywho, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's crazy to me. It's really actually crazy to me how there's like not really any sort of competitor to YouTube. Like the closest I can think of is like Vimeo, but their business model is the opposite where you like pay to put your videos on it rather than them paying you to have your videos on there. 
And it's like, why would I ever want to put my videos on Vimeo if I didn't have to? I know there are some YouTube channels specifically that will put some of their videos on Vimeo because they, um, because Vimeo is less strict about things like copyright. <laughs> Uh, so they'll put like the. F I know there are one or two reaction channels out there that will put like the full uncut reactions on Vimeo and like so you subscribe to their Patreon and then the link that they give you is a Vimeo link because they couldn't put it on <laughs> YouTube uh that is one of the few use cases I could actually see for putting anything on Vimeo. I mean, yeah, you've got all sorts of platforms that have, you know, some sort of video sharing capacity. You know, Facebook has it, you've got like Instagram Reels, which is the same company, so I'm not sure why I'm mentioning it twice. Uh, of course, there's like TikTok, but that's a different type of video that's theoretically all short form, although they've been getting longer and longer. Um, so, I mean, everyone's taking a crack at it, but nobody really feels like actual competition for YouTube. And I mean, that could be because, you know, they're backed by the, the, arguably the biggest tech company in the entire world, but, you know, uh, it's just, it's just, uh, it's just, it's just whatever, yeah, it's just whatever. Yeah, I'm talking about Google, which in itself is owned by Alphabet, which I had never heard of until diving deeper into the, the YouTube rabbit hole that is YouTube itself. Oh. Okay, well. <laughs> we are not playing very well this episode. I must say. Um. It might be a... I might have to call it a batch after this episode, because... This is a... Uh, this is an unfortunate performance on an otherwise stellar run. I wouldn't want to ruin it. Well and truly. Yep. Okay, okay. It's fine. We'll take that. And that will be our last hoop. Probably. Whip. Oh. He's in the air. Nope. Doesn't count. 22k is not terrible, but it's not great either. I want... What I want to do with this run, with this game, you know, this, these, these couple of balls that I have left, I want to get a high score. Like a full-on, not just, not just on the board, but like the highest score on this board. Because then I can actually convince myself that I might be getting Yay, small bonus. Yay. That's great. Boop, boop. Uh, let's just, I kind of want to, I kind of want to, I kind of want to just catch right now. I kind of want to do that. Just a little bit. Honestly, it might be the time that's getting to me, because uh, I am usually going to bed about this time <laughs> that I am recording this, so... That might be what's happening there, in all truth. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? Is that a Zangoose? Zangoose. What would have been my first shiny if, if I hadn't, uh, if I knew what shinies were at the time? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a fun story. Um, I have told it on the channel before, but uh, the TLDR is. Uh, when I was but a wee child, I ran into a shiny Zangoose, which has a blue stripe on it. 
you know, all the parts that are red or blue instead. It's like, wow, this is a neat. This is a this is a new Pokemon, right? This is a different Pokemon. That's what I thought. I thought it was just a different Pokemon. I was like, okay, I'll probably run into another one at some point. And then I never did. And then I learned what shinies are. And then I was like, oh. This was all the way back in third gen, by the way. <laughs> I don't remember whether it was Ruby, Sapphire, or Emerald, but it was one of them. I think Zangus is exclusive to either Ruby or Sapphire. Um, so it was either that or Emerald. Uh, whichever one Zangus is actually in. I think it's supposed to be in Ruby, I want to say. I don't remember. But what I do remember Balls, bitch. <laughs> Hear that, Quay Quay? Who's a bitch? Ow. Okay, I guess I deserve that. Bonk. And... Oh, okay, he's gone. He's gone for now. Yeah, so is the ball. Okay, okay, this is good. We love to see it. Oh, thought I was gonna hit him. Thought I was gonna be sneaky right there and hit him. Not quite. God, I love this game. God, they need to make another one of these games. Why haven't they? I'm half tempted to try and make one myself. <laughs> uh, honestly, it's not too far-fetched to make like a pinball game. Not necessarily like a Pokemon pinball game, because I mean, yes, you could make a fan game, but, um, but, to, but I think just generally having a, it's still a novel idea that really hasn't been done to have a pinball game that has like some sort of meta progression to it. And I guess there are probably like pinball games that have come out since the PS3 and 360 that have like achievements probably and trophies but like I don't know man I haven't heard of any of them and also it doesn't feel like it's the same if it's not like in the game itself but hey we're at three bill so that's cool alrighty it's a fun little trick there. Just to slow it down a bit. Clip. Thank you, Pichu. Alright, what can we get out of this slot here? This dirty, dirty slot. Uh, <clears throat> a bonus multiplier. That's pretty neat. You know, one other thing I could look up if I found the manual to this game is what the hell that little sign... You know, you see the one right there next to the entrance to the Mart? There's seven on it right now. What the hell does that do? <laughs> now it says eight. What is it? What is, it? What is that? What is... Surely it does something, but I have no idea what. Nine now. I assume, I assume it's some sort of multiplier. But I have no idea. And the fact that I've seen it up to like 50 something. I feel like that should mean something. Uh oh. This was not my intent. Thank you, Pichu. I am sorry about that, Whiskash. I didn't mean to. All right. 30 second ball saver, I'll take that. And perhaps I will take it again next time. Because uh, as for this episode, that's a wrap.
this seems like a good spot. 